Okay, all right, CD Wayne. Hello, my students. Uh, as you can see, this is a HP 15, right? With KB0912. You see embedded inside of the IO controller with the BIOS inside of the IO controller. I have the RTH09F. As you can see, I've soldered the wires to the keyboard connector, right? I've soldered the wires to the keyboard connector there, right? And I have a ground. This is my ground pin. Right, and it's connected to ground, right? And you can see the software now. I'm now saving this as KB HP 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 15 underscore LA, which is a compal board that's L A dash A996 underscore backup okay backup all right so i'll just save this to the desktop all right and i'm going to reprogram this bios in a short time all right and here we're back now so remember this is a hp 15 all right la a 996p motherboard let's see if i can get this to focus not focusing at all all right anyway we're going to load or open our new bios ec bios backup file all right and we're going to name this let's see what the name of the file is one and this one is 128 kb all right and, uh, this is 128 kb Let's see. All right. Nope, sir. That's not it. Two meg. I think I passed it. All right. Here's it. All right. Here's it. All right. One twenty-eight KB. All right, and I'm gonna click right. Right, so now as you can see, it says writing should start writing chip, and as you can see, the lights are flashing. Right, let me just see. Right, the lights are flashing, and it's programming the EC BIOS. Okay, right, okay, now low and CD Wayne. As you can see, the light is now lit. I have fixed this board with the KB0. With, sorry with the rtf 098 here right very good programmer right as you can see it has wires it is connected to this pcb and it's connected directly to the keyboard connector here i've removed it as you can see it's very dirt um, messy with the flux um but the greatest thing is that i have fixed it and i have lights glowing at my dc jack and now it was before it was no light it was dead i have standby voltage like all working conditions of the ich i'm sorry of the haswell chipset and adapter insertion test signal from the IO controller is present and standby voltage is ready hence the only option is to reprogram this IO to see if we get light and it has been fixed as you can see and it is lit right so thanks for watching